Alright guys, today we're going to be talking about these amazing caimans. Are they so amazing? <laughs> they are. That's, that's what we are wondering. So yes. today, we read this. We actually read this with our teacher. We went over it because we probably need some help finding the answers for that. But this is not what we're going to be doing today. Today we are going to be giving facts. Yeah, yeah, that's that's totally. so, so today, the first step is oh, um, that now they have ways to protect themselves. They have sharp teeth and strong jaws. Their skin is tough like armor. And my my fact is that is that um. It says, is this hatchling in danger? No, its mother is carrying it, carrying it in her mouth, mouth to keep it safe. Let's see this picture right there. There's the hatchling, and it's in the mother's mouth, mouth to keep it safe. Okay, go Ashley. Okay. Um, my, I'm curious of that. How do you know that? The hatchling and the mother caveman and the father that the father and the mother will keep them safe and that it's really that what I love is how the mother is is keeping them safe to not get not be you know taken away by any other animals like in the wild yeah. stuff. I really I don't want to get bitten by one but I'm really sad if they do. I just want to take care of animals, not really keep them. Yeah, because they could be in in and danger, really danger by by hungry foxes or lizards. Yeah. Or so that's so so really how do they keep them safe from that? And yes. that's one thing I just read about about being in the mother's mouth. And the way that I think they should be safe is that it says it in the story is that they have them covered with dirt and plants so the other wild um, foxes or lizards or any animal cannot get them and take them away from their mom and father and so i hope i really glad that their mother and their father can keep them safe yeah. I think um, uh, 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 another fact is that um, it says after a few years the clim the caimans are full grown. Some caimans can be as long as 15 feet. That's about as long as a um, a can a can of that's one of my facts. Um, my other fact is it says dangers from hatchling. The mothers carry them wait, sorry. The mother carries them to the water but they are still not safe. They are also that small that birds can stroke and eat them. I didn't know birds could eat them. I thought they could eat birds. But <laughs> Okay. Um, another fact that I want to do is that how I wonder that hatchlings can swim in a deep lake. It's just that I have a um, I have a I used to have a lizard in my classroom that was a baby and and um that we all loved the the lizard because it was a baby and it was things 
that one. Bye. <laughs> Wait, I got one more thing to say. These caimans, hatchlings, caimans live in rivers and swamps in Central, in Central America and South America. So they live... They will live in America, but only in Central and South. So, yeah. So, bye guys. Subscribe and like our post. Dude, if you have a big test, do go on it. Take your time. Real story. Rock it. Because this is what we have to do. We have to answer questions. So, so, so we so are be doing that in the next video. Yeah, we'll do that in the next video. So, so bye. bye. Oh, we forgot.